Tomorrow marks 50 years since the launch of the Apollo 11 mission to the moon. And to commemorate that milestone, the Smithsonian is going big. 363 feet tall, to <laughs> be exact. Heather Graff is live for us on the National Mall with the final preps underway right now. Heather, this is awesome. It really is, Michelle and Allison, and the excitement is building here on the National Mall. If you take a look behind me, you will see the countdown clock and several large monitors all lit up while crews complete some final tests. All of this as they prepare to project a 363 foot image of a Saturn V rocket on the Washington Monument. As the sun sets on this Monday evening, that's our kind of primary viewing area. It's the moon that Richard Slaney is focused on. Yeah, this is crunch time. We're pretty busy. He's the managing director of a London-based production company that's teamed up with the Smithsonian Air and Space Museum for a special project. The 50th anniversary of the Apollo 11 mission. That's one small step for man. And the moment in history it represents. The Apollo program is, is incredibly inspiring because it's all about collaboration. It's all about sort of the sense of what we as humans can do rather than as individuals. So it's only fitting that what's happening this week is a group effort as well, a celebration of the moon landing that will project the life-size image of the Saturn V rocket onto the Washington Monument. And it's a 17-minute projection show, so we use the monument as our surface and we use the screens here and we have an amazing soundtrack as well. This afternoon's sound check offering a bit of a sneak peek for people like Gerald and Kitty Moore, who are here visiting from Arizona. Oh, I think that's wonderful. Because they remember what it was like all those years ago. It brings back old memories. Crying and cheering and yeah. yeah. Lots of tears. Good moment in time. And that, Richard told us. And then we have a piece of LED, which is going to represent the, the countdown clock in the center. Is what these next few days are all about. I'm just looking forward to seeing their reaction. All right, so the projection on the Washington Monument officially starts tomorrow night, but that is just a small part of this anniversary celebration. You can find all of the details over on WJLA.com. For now, we're live tonight on the National Mall. Heather Graff, ABC 7 News.